Ladies and gentlemen, let's read Game Intercom video. We have yet more news on the PlayStation 4, this time regarding on how digital titles work on different machines. For example, let's say that you have an account on your own PlayStation 4. There was some question to what would happen if you bought a digital title. So, for example, let's say Infamous. And you were to go around your friend's house, for example, Bob. What would happen? Could you play your titles on his system using your account? And the answer is yes, you can. This is absolutely fantastic news, although not really surprising, given that Sony's previous stance on digital titles. Neil Brown, who is Sony's R&D senior team leader, actually has commented on this and has said, and I quote, you can visit your friend's house and you can log in and play your games from your digital library, which is good. But how useful is that if it takes half a day to download the game you want to play? With play as you download, you get much quicker access to at least the first section of the game, so you can start playing quicker. So this makes a digital library a practical option in the real world. A similar system also works on Blu-ray chunks, as all on Blu-ray as chunks are automatically copied to the hard drive in the background. This means that after a few minutes, your game can rely on having faster read speeds from the hard drive, which provides a better experience for players, and this is completely background process from the player. They don't have to wait anymore to install before playing the game. The game will launch as soon as the disc is put into the drive. End quote. This is pretty cool. To be honest, from my own perspective, as someone who has pre-ordered the PS4, I'm not exactly shocked about this news, although it's more of a confirmation. As, for example, you can log on to your friend's PSN account, or your friend rather can log on on their PSN account around your house, and of course, download titles and so forth. That is absolutely fine. In this case, from what we're reading, you do need your account logged in to access those titles. So, pretty cool stuff. It means, of course, that if you go around your friend's house, you can take your products with you. This is really cool because, obviously, with the players you download option, the primary reason I like this is simple. I'm sure many of you know the pain of you've bought a game and simply waiting for the bloody thing to download. And even if you've got a reasonably fast internet connection, it can be a bit of a pain. Uh... Personally, I have 120 megabytes per second, but even so, if I could start playing within, say, one minute or two minutes of uh, purchasing a game, that would be a hell of a lot better than waiting, say, 10 minutes after purchasing a game. It's also worth noting, of course, that with, well, game size is going to be definitely getting a hell of a lot bigger over the next couple of years, thanks to, of course, a Blu-ray. No doubt we're going to be very thankful of this uh, service. Anyway, this has been a fairly short video to say the least, but hopefully you found it at least somewhat entertaining. I will see you soon. Take care and bye for now.